Over 80% of trans youth have admitted to having thoughts about unaliving themselves, and over 50% have actually attempted it. In these individuals, denying them care that we know is life-saving is child abuse. Send this to anybody who agrees with what that woman just said. We're going to debunk this in 60 seconds. That woman is a family doctor advocating that kids be able to medically transition. She says she's read the studies. Clearly the biased ones because the United States has only done one nonpartisan evidence review and found that there was insufficient evidence to allow for this form of treatment. She mentions young people unaliving themselves because they don't get treatment, but fails to mention that young people with gender dysphoria often have multiple psychiatric diagnoses. They've also been found to have a very high rate of autism. She also fails to mention that both Sweden and Finland have done extensive research into this and found that the scientific evidence to support intervention with minors is actually zero. The left loves to use Sweden and Finland as examples of utopic countries, but fails to mention that they only allow this treatment for minors in exceptional cases. Reminder, she's a doctor.